Hello everyone, Kenjiru Jinkoto, and I'm back for our fourth part of arguably the greatest guitar solo ever recorded, Eddie Van Halen's Eruption. Alright, so now we are getting into one of the more difficult parts, all the tremolo picking or alternate picking, very constant so that came in right after the dive bomb. Then we get into that. Then we get into the uh, unison bend here on the 15th and the 12th fret, right? So. So let's go through that as far as exactly what is happening. Okay, so after the dive bomb on the low E, and as it's coming up, okay, as it's coming up, we get into that unison bend here. Right? Then you tremolo, your tremolo picking begins here on the 12th fret. Okay, so you got to remember, and I've emphasized this in some of my other videos, and if you guys are not familiar with this and you struggle with this type of picking, go back and watch some of my other videos, especially the one I did right before Eruption, which is the Devil's Blues and Arpeggios, that one. So, what we're going to do here, you want to keep... You want to keep your pick really close to the string. You don't want to have really wide, you know, picking pattern. You want to keep it very tight. Use your use your fingers, you know, or your ring finger or both your pinky and your ring finger to kind of brace your hand, right? And if, if that's not comfortable for you, um, I don't know what to say other than, you know, you got to try to use very small strokes what they're calling economic picking but all it really is is you want little as little of movement as possible you know we, we want short very condensed movement okay so so we're going to go from the 12th to the 16th okay then to the 19th and then to the 17th. Okay, so it's going to be like that. Okay. So now we're repeating that. So we're going, you know, on this note right here, we're repeating. All right, so it's going to go here, then we're going to go here, then here, then here, okay, then here again. Now it repeats. We're going to repeat this note right here, and then we're going to go to this note right here. Okay, so it'll go like this. And then back to 12. And then back to 12, okay, so. Okay. So we do that twice, okay. Now, after having done that twice, here, 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 
then here, then here, then here, then here, then here, and then one more time. So here, 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 then back to here, then here, okay, and then back to 12. And once we get back to 12, now, now the pattern is going to go here to here, 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 and then lastly, we'll put, lastly, we're going to pull off right there on the high E, and then we're going to go five, three, one, and then grab the G and bend it up and let it down, and as we do, pull on that high, uh, low E and do another dive bomb with the bar, okay? That's what we're doing. So again, it's from the unison bend. This is what it looks like here. Okay, one more time. I'm going to just recap what frets one more time. Um, I'm not going to have the volume on and do all the picking and everything like I just did. Uh, just as a reminder, if you guys have made it this far, the very next video is going to be the most difficult part of the song, without a doubt. So this is, this is pretty difficult right here, but the next part is even more difficult with the pattern and all these pull-offs that he does. So if you got this far, you're doing well. And let me just recap what frets we're using. All right. So again, we got the unison bend on 15 and 12. And then the tremolo picking begins on 12 here. Then we go up to fret 16. And then we go to fret 19. And then we go to fret 18. And then we go back to fret 16, or I'm sorry, okay, 12, 16, 19, 17, back to 16, then back to 17, and then we go to 14, all right, and then 12, 14, and then 10 and 12, and then 9 and 10, and then 7 and 9, 5 and 7, 3 and 5, 2 and 3, and then pull off, and then we're going to go on the B string, Five, three, one, off. Grab the G on the second fret. <coughs> Bend it up. And as we let it down, pull down on the low E, do a dive bomb. That is the sequence. So one last time, okay? 
one last time. everyone thank you very much for watching and being attentive to these videos and i hope that you enjoy them and again the next video is going to be the more difficult part for eruption and then after that it goes into the tapping and then that'll be the end so there'll be two more parts left and uh, i hope that you guys have stuck with me and i hope you enjoy this and that you've learned a lot and especially this section here, this segment, will definitely improve your picking without a doubt for alternate picking. But again, thank you very much. Hope you enjoyed it. Please don't forget to hit the notification bell. And I would greatly appreciate it if you would like, share, and subscribe. Thank you very much. And I will see you in the next part of this guitar lesson for playing Eruption by Eddie Van Halen. Thank you again, and have a great one, everyone.